On behalf of the Great Lakes Indian Fish and Wildlife Commission, its member nations, its staff, we welcome you here to the Minwajimo Symposium, telling the good story. We come here today really to use Glyphwick's 25th anniversary as kind of a hook, as a device, to gather together nations. And here, the nations have sent their representatives with their pipes. And we have the dragons, the drums, that will be here throughout the course. That's to remind us that what we're really here about is about those communities, those nations that made their word with each other, with each other amongst themselves and with the United States in treaties signed so long ago. And that over the last 25 to 40 years, these nations have taken great effort and make, made great strides to have those rights recognized, not only within their own communities, but with the other governments and the other communities with which they deal on a regular basis. And not only the recognition, but actually exercising the rights, implementing them in a way that works for tribal communities, that fits within their sovereignty and in partnership with those other governments. And so that's the story that we will be hearing over the next day and a half at the panels, which are designed to be conversations. They're not designed to be talking at you, but to be speaking with you and to be talking amongst ourselves. Please join us as our nations and their representatives and friends from other nations and other communities open us up today. And the drum heard around the world in the Sakaga Chippewa community will start us off in a good way. Miigwech and welcome. <laughs> 